being a woman means having no boundaries, having, oh, hold on. Whoa, then is that right? I'm going to start over no boundaries. <laughs> Can I yeah, clap? Yeah. Slight cut. I don't know if I was always like this. I wasn't always like this, but I'm in this era of just like really fully embracing everything about myself. So for me, for example, I come from Haiti. Like just owning even like little things about my culture, the way that we cook, owning the way that we dress, owning the way that we handle situations, owning what it is to be a woman, all the beautiful, beautiful things it means to be a woman. Just owning this life, you know, like what are you here to do? In my community, there's a lot of different things when it comes to like hair. You know, there's a lot of different styles, there's a lot of different things that we embrace, there's a lot of things that we don't embrace. Especially growing up in like South Florida, it's all about like having like super long hair, whether it's yours or not, spending an outrageous amount of money on it. And there was just a point in time where I was like, this doesn't make sense. Not for me at least, you know? I wanted to do something a little bit more natural, something that probably just didn't make sense to a lot of people. and. I just really owned my look. I paid like an insane amount of money for this weave and for this install and like I went to Trinidad and within like two days it was already shedding. Like the thousand dollar wig that I just bought was already shedding. I was like, okay, I don't even care. I, I was so over hair at that time. And then the expectation of how you're supposed to look and how you're supposed to style your hair. and. It's a lot, and I was just over it. And so, um, yeah, I cut it all off. Are you recording? I sent the video of when I first cut my hair, and it's like, oh my God, I think this might be my new look, and I haven't looked back. In modeling, it was a risk because I was known for a certain look, and I just wanted to just be me. Like, when I walked into a room, I didn't want to feel uncomfortable about anything. I wanted to own my body type, I wanted to own my look, and it's been amazing. Uh, so many opportunities have come since I've cut my hair. I am me, like what you see is me in its rawest, unfiltered form, and it's, it's beautiful. I am Sage, I am a mother, I am a sister, I'm a daughter, I am a spicy Haitian woman. <laughs> I am me.